Hello everyone, so uh, this is the solution of yesterday's countless problem C called Strange Birthday Party. Okay, so the question is that you know we have n friends and there's an integer assigned to each friend called ki. For ith friend, we have ki integer assigned to it. Uh, now we would like to give a present to each of them. In the nearby shop, there are m unique presents available basically, and the jth present costs cj dollars. The presents are given in sorted order as we can see and it's not allowed to buy a single present more than once. Okay, so and it's not allowed to buy a single present more than once. Cool. For the ith friend Petya, uh, can buy them a present J less than equal to Ki which costs CJ dollars or just give them CK dollars directly. Help Petya determine the minimum cost of housing his party, hosting, hosting his party. So the question is very confusing for the first five to ten minutes you know, when you're reading it because the language is very very confusing but the logic is pretty simple. We just have to read this line that for the ith friend, uh, just wait a minute. Uh, uh, for the ith friend, Petya can either be present when j is less than equal to ki. This is ki, and the indexes are j. When j is less than ki, uh, we can buy them a present which costs CJ dollars. Matlab when J is less than KI, we can buy them any present from uh, 0 to less than equal to K and such that the present has not repeated itself. Or if it's greater than KI, we ha just have to, you know, uh, give them CKI dollars directly. Okay, so the first intuition is we have to think it, we have to think, you know, how can we can do this greedily, like CKI dollars. Directly, we'll give them CK dollars, you know, when J would be greater than or equal to K. So we want this to be minimum, right? We like we want this to be minimum possible. So what we can do is, okay, and we want this also to be minimum. Basically, we want you know whatever we are taking, we are taking the minimum value. So you know this statement now, it's not actually making sense now. Yeah, we'll buy a single present, but you know we can also give similar amount of cash. Right, the, we this we have really no restriction at all. So how to, how we will approach this? We will sort the input array. Basically, this ki wala array will sort it in reverse order. So when we will sort it in reverse order, will initial element will be the greatest. What we will do is you know if we'll make an will you know will create an index j. If j is less than that index v of i, which is which which is representing ki, we will take the minimum value from ci. So let's you know, let's let's just do a dry run. Let's suppose you know, if if we basically the question is that we have to arrange this in such a way that you know this whole becomes minimum, and this will become minimum. You know when we'll sort that. Uh, in reverse order because then CKI would be a uh, minimum because initially it would be KI would be greater than J because uh, J would be 0, 1, 2 but KI would be more because KI will, will have the maximum value right but if we sort it then initially the value will be bigger and J is obviously more than it can be more than it can be more than it but the chance is that it will be more than it so when the value will come when J cross K then that time they guarantee that CKI will be minimum because because if we look that example, we can see that you know five हम दो बार ले सकते हैं। मतलब we can give money ना, तो that's one thing. Okay, तो basically तो question में इससे बन जाता है कि हमको input array sort करना है, ये वाला in such a way that उसको sort करके ये जो चीज है वो हमारी maximum बन जाए। और ये तरीका तब है जब हम इसको sort करें उल्टे तरीके में, मतलब four पहले आए four three three two two। तो एक बार मैं diagram दिखा दूँ कि काम कैसे करेगा ये, then you will understand. This is very easy, but मतलब not very uh, this is very intuitive, but it's difficult to believe that it, this works. Like when I thought of it, ना तो I couldn't believe that this is the solution. Okay, so four, three, three, two, two, right? So this is the input array, and three, five, twelve, twenty. Three, five, twelve, twenty is the present array. 
मतलब कॉस्ट है राइट सो विल टेक फोर सो यू नो वी कैन टेक एनी इंडेक्स विच इज लेस देन फोर सो लेट्स टेक थ्री एड थ्री टू द आंसर Now we can take any number which is less than three. Three is zero, one, two, three. Three is this. So we will taking. We are taking five. Then for this we are taking twelve because you know we can only take each present. Well, we can take a present only once. So twelve would be added to the answer. Then for this here, okay. So K I would be this. Either J our zero was, either J our one was, either J our था इधर जे हमारा थ्री हो गया नाउ जे जे इज ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू के नाउ वी हैव टू टेक सी के डॉलर्स दैट इज यू नो मैंडेटरी रियली कांट डू एनीथिंग सो सी के डॉलर्स वुड बी अ 2 इंडेक्स 2 पे हैव मतलब सिंस इंडेक्सिंग इसमें वन से है बट हमने जो से करे तो इट इज इधर बेसिकली 5 है तो वी आर टेकिंग 5 नाउ सिंस अगेन जे इज ग्रेटर देन इक्वल टू के वी आर टेकिंग 5 राइट so we are taking 5 once more so 5 5 5 15 or 15 30 30 answer hoga okay, iska let let us verify okay this dance is 30 so yeah humko basically isko aise arrange karna hai taki ye cheez hamari minimum ho jaye aur isko tab ye tabhi minimum hogi jab basically isko hum sort karenge ulte order mein let's just see the code waise is code explanation ho gaya to i don't think code required hai but okay sense okay so maine do array input liye n size kare banaya m size kare banaya a and b n ए आई का जो इंडेक्सिंग है उसको मैंने माइनस माइनस के मुझे इंडेक्सिंग जीरो से करनी है वैसे भी कर सकते हैं बट मुझे फिर इसमें एक साइज फालतू करना पड़ेगा और वो अलग बकवास हो जाएगी सो देन आई हैव टेकन एन एरे इनपुट एम विच इज बेसिकली द कॉस्ट एरे आई हैव शॉर्ट द फर्स्ट एरे रिवर्स द फर्स्ट एरे नाउ द इनिशियल द फर्स्ट एलिमेंट इज द लार्जेस्ट एलिमेंट आई हैव क्रिएटेड एन इंडेक्स करंट नाउ यू नो सिंपली ट्रवर्सिंग द एरे ट्रवर्सिंग दिस एरे Now, if current is less than equal to i, the same condition. If current is basically less than equal to k i, a i is storing the k i, then current plus plus and answer plus equal to b i, because you know we can only take the one element only once, so that's why you know we are doing current plus plus to make sure that you know we are following the restrictions. अगर if that's not the case, you know when basically j is greater than equal to k, simply answer plus equal to b of a i. B of k, C of k is as said as stated in the as stated in the question. Just following the question, yeah, that was the code. This is like very simple. After seeing the solution, but believe me, you know when you are trying this on your own, it can become dicey. And after just printing the solution answer, yeah. So that was the code. I will attach the question and the solution in the description. So if you want to check that out, you can check that out. It's on you. Ah, uh, thank you very much for watching. Okay, bye.